What's going on guys, it is your boy Beer Bubbles here, and I'm sorry but today's video is very short just because of the fact that, um, I couldn't like, I couldn't get as much clips as I wanted to, Be like I could get the clips but it was like just a one kill kind of thing, and it was really hard to get like my clips to save because if you guys didn't know I just use Share Factory so it was really hard for me to get the clips, but today's video is about, um, it's about the best gun in Call of Duty. Oh, at the moment, this thing is really overpowered. I'm playing core free for all right now, and this is what I was playing for all of these clips. I just kind of, one of my friends, the awful player, he's he's a he's a he's a, pr he's a really funny guy. You guys should go sub to him, and also go sub to Alpha Delta. These guys are all good. These guys are like, like they're all Yeet Squad members, right? So everybody go sub down to them. I'll put the description or I'll put them in the description down below. And yeah, go show them some love. Tell them I con or I told you guys about them. And yeah, but I'm a I'm gonna tell you guys why this is probably the best gun. Well, first of all, it's the attachments that you put on the gun, and the attachments that I ran for all of these free for all clips. It's the same thing every time. And the attachments were grip, quick draw. I th it was either stock or um oh what's the other one called extended mags. So it was one of those two. I would really recommend you guys use those. It's probably the best thing. You can run any perks because it's free for all, so you guys run your setup for free for all. But use those exact attachments, and you'll do just fine. You don't, you don't need a sight on here. I find I don't know if it was just me, but I found that whenever I was um using this, it was really hard to use a sight on here just because of the fact that it was um i don't know it was just really hard to use a sight on here just for me because i'm not used to the amount of kick that you would get for that so it was kind of hard it was kind of hard to keep a sight on here without it like bouncing everywhere and stuff but yeah that's what i would recommend for the class setup and yeah so that's really what i would just recommend for the class setup and i could tell you guys about I could tell you guys what to run for perks, I guess. This is what I ran. But like I said, if you guys prefer uh, a different setup, just use this. There, This is what I'm going to tell you guys. But I was running Ghost, Momentum, and Pinpoint. You don't really need Pinpoint, but I was using it just because I was like only level 16 or 17 or something like that. But, yeah. But I would just really recommend you guys use this gun. All the pros have been using it. If you guys have been watching the, the competitive series... I haven't seen one person not use that thing. It's just so it's just so good. Like honestly, it's the one of the best things ever. But yeah, I would just really recommend you guys use this gun because it'll probably if you guys are core players, this gun would really help you guys out. There's no nuke variant, so the only thing you can really go for is juggernaut medals, which are still good. But you know, you always want to call on that deatomizer strike. But, yeah, if you guys already haven't, check out the other video, and I'll put it down in the description. It's me, Carnage Dismo, and Paradox all getting a deatomizer in one game. It was an incredible gameplay. I went, like, 51-2, and two, Paradox, like, 51, or 54-3, and three, or something like that, and then Dismo yeah, did the same thing as Paradox, I'm pretty sure, but we all dropped one. P almost dropped a double. He died three off because he ran out of ammo. But, yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video, and I hope you guys enjoyed. And really, I would recommend use this gun. But, yeah, I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Peace.